What is up, Cosmic Gang? It is a beautiful Sunday. I hope you're enjoying the sun. I hope you're enjoying this day to yourself. I hope you are living inspired today. Um, okay, so for our daily vibes today, and I really asked Source to come through with a message for the collective consciousness. Um, the first one that came out was Seven of Swords. This is known as the card of deception in tarot. But as I read the energies on this card, um, this is a past deception. So this is feeling guilty for our own past deceptions. So we're starting to take accountability here and for how we have deceived ourselves and others. So you're going to be reevaluating some of the ways that maybe you used to move, used to do things, used to, um, used to carry certain energies. And you're going to be feeling kind of guilty for the way that you've deceived others at this time. This may also be a slightly past energy. You may have experienced this in the last day or two. And I feel like this is really what we're moving into, which is the Two of Cups. Up, upright was the next card I pulled. So the reason why I say this feels like of even the way we have deceived ourselves and others we're feeling guilty for at this time is because this Two of Cups came out upright. Um, and I was reading the energy for the card before I really pulled the Two of Cups. When the Two of Cups came out, I was like, okay, this is definitely confirmation for what I'm feeling. So this Two of Cups is rectifying uh, certain energies, uh, rectifying these old energies of deception, self-deception, and how we have deceived others. Um, it's also moving forward in a space of harmony and balance. It also might be some DNA, you know, Kundalini awakenings. So, and then these are cups. So once again, this is dealing with emotion. So we used our logic to deceive and we're using our emotion to actually rectify these energies. So that is beautiful. So the bottom of the deck was two of swords, which I thought was very interesting. When I saw two of swords, immediately I thought of overthinking. Immediately I thought of like agony, the agony of overthinking things and really being like, I used to be like this. I don't know if I should trust this person. I don't know if I should do this. I don't know if I should do that anymore. And Spirit is really asking us to stop overthinking things. Choose the path that is most in, in alignment for you. If you know that those past energies brought you nothing but heartache and are making you feel guilty at this time, why would you continue to indulge in them? Let it go and move forward with grace and harmony. So you all take care. And that is our daily vibes. If you would like your own personal reading, you can either message me or you can um, email me at empressisabel.info at gmail.com. If you are on my Instagram, I do have a book button as well. Take care. Bye, guys.